Troll, 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 On MMKD News today, we'll be talking about events that have happened in the local school of George Salter Academy. The school of success and triumph. The school's successful basketball teams tell us about their success. The school's annual production of Hairspray. And the plans for the future Neil build and the people behind the whole thing. With me, Kirsty Deakin. And me, Molly White. We will start off with a report about the school's production of Hairspray. As you all know, the Academy's production this year is Hairspray. The whole of the cast have been rehearsing since October and the show has started this Tuesday. We will now talk to a member of the dance cast on their experience in Hairspray. Hi, I'm Daniel and I'm part of the dance cast in Hairspray. Hello, I'm, pa- I'm Rhiannon and I'm part of the dance cast. What's your favourite dance in Hairspray? Welcome to the 60s because there's like funky moves and we all know it off by heart. Yeah, mine's Welcome to the 60s. What have you enjoyed most about the rehearsals? Meeting new people and getting to know who they are like really in and out of school. Being able to freedom to do what we want and to be able to wear like emphasise our moves. Have you enjoyed working as a full dance cast? Yeah, because like we've become close over the years and we've all mixed and got to know each other. What are show nights like as part of the dance cast? They're like, sometimes we argue, but we're all like friends again because we're all like one big family. Yeah, it's really fun because we get to all um, get ready together and be able to perform together. Do you enjoy performing as a dance cast? Yeah, because like, if we get stuck, we all help each other and just laugh and smile about it. Okay, thank you for your time and good luck with the rest of the shows. Thank you. Some of the acting cats. My name is Jess and I play the gym teacher in Hairspray. I'm, my name is Zara and I play a special ed kid in Hairspray. Have you enjoyed working in Hairspray this year? Yeah, it was fun. Yeah, it's fun. You get to meet new people that you don't really like know outside of school. So. Uh, would you do it again next year? Yeah, I would. Yeah, would, fun. would you want to go for a bigger part or just stay the same? I'd like... To go for a big part still. Yeah, I don't worry. I wouldn't, I wouldn't really care. Just get a part in it. I like it all together. I'd, I'd be happy if I got a part, but I'd be happy to be a little part in it still. Were you glad that you joined Hairspray and that you got the part? Yeah. Yeah. Um, what's your favourite part in Hairspray? Like, it can be behind the scenes or actually on the stage. I, I like the big doll's house. Yeah, my, my favourite part is like um, scene two from then on. It's just really fun. Yeah, because we're just at the back watching it all. Have you made any new memories? Yeah, because like in rehearsals and stuff, when you're waiting, you just talk and you get to know people more and you get close to other people. Yeah, when you're waiting to go, you just talk a lot. Have you overall enjoyed your experience in Hairspray? Yeah, yeah, I love it. Okay, thank you and good luck with the rest of the show. Okay, um, I'm Dalton and I play Link Larkin. I'm James and I play Edna Turnblad. I'm Cameron and I play Wilbur Turnblad. I'm Jada and I play Baltimore Mathematics. What's it like working in Hasbro? Um, it's fun, enjoyable, you meet new people, just loads of laughs. So yeah, I like it. Um, it's just like going into another decade. At the same, well, not only are you acting the part, but you are actually learning something new at the same time. I completely agree with these two. Um, it's been an amazing experience, like both having to play someone who's absolutely a wacko and, be, and like try and fit in with all these other people. It's just really enjoy- enjoyable. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I've never done um, a musical before, and it's just a great experience to have. That was really enjoyable. Um, have you learned anything new from working in Hasbro? Um, um, there's always going to be new challenges every year, and the thing is with hairspray is it's just, it's just going to oh it's just it's alright I like it. <laughs> um, I mean, like talking to um, all the people that I've met this year who have been in musical before, it's sort of like learning how to act in a musical, how to like treat like props and set, and it's been really useful. Because I'm thinking about doing it next year, so it's nice to know. I've learned that singing and dancing is a lot harder than it actually is, trust me. <laughs> and I can't dance to save my life, so I've learned a bit of. It's 
still so cool. I agree with James about the dancing. I cannot dance, and you, if you see it, you will know. Would you do anything different about the show to improve on next year if you're in it? Um, well, I think some of the main cast thought it was all right to like save their lives. So like we were sort of, we were all like, okay, we don't need to learn them just yet. But I think we should have just been a bit more dedicated to it because it's quite it's affected us. Speak for yourself, these do <laughs> straight away. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> um, I think it's gone pretty well. Um, I can't really. Th I'm trying to think of improvements right now, but I really can't. So um, I guess it's just agree more dedication um, with some of the parts, uh, maybe the dancers, then like, a bit quicker. Not saying anything, but you know. Um, so yeah. Well, there's, there's always going to be improvements, no matter what you do. There's always you always have to leave room for improvement. To be honest, and we are actually secondary school children, but I think. This year, everyone is just absolutely amazing. It's just, um, I cannot fault them that much. <laughs> <laughs> Are you proud to call yourself the Hairspray Boys? I, I play a woman, so I'm not <laughs> Well, boy slash woman. <laughs> um, yes, I'm proud. I'm proud. Yeah, definitely proud. I'm very, I am very proud. Playing an old man, so yes, I'm very proud. Overall, are you proud of yourselves of what you've achieved this year? And final question, have you enjoyed Hairspray? Yes. Yes, yes definitely. Most of the time it's been good. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for your time and good luck. Thank you. Talk to a member of the backstage crew. This is Jordan Brown and he's one of the backstage cast in Hairspray. Um, what's it like working backstage of Hairspray? Yeah, it's good. Uh, you get to help out, do an experience you've never done before and stuff like that. Have you learnt any new skills from working backstage in Hairspray? Uh, yeah, you learn how to move like sets. So it gets you experience, so like, in case you want to do it in the future and that. Um, have you made any new friends or like people? Yeah, met new people in the show. Yeah, uh, I've met most of the cast. Have you enjoyed working in Hairspray overall? Yeah, it's been a fun, enjoyable experience, and I'll do it again next year. Would you want, ever want to become like part of the Hairspray cast? Yeah, I would. Or would you, would you definitely work backstage again next year? If it's a good show next year, I will audition, but I'm thinking of auditioning next year anyway. But if I don't get part backstage again. Okay, thank you for your time, and good luck with the rest of Hairspray. Thank you. Move on to the subjects of the basketball teams and the new build. Go. First of all, congratulations to the under 16s basketball team who won 26 20 against Samuel Academy. Now they'll be entered into the Black Country Youth Games. Also, the girls' team who came runners up in the West Midlands Cup. Well done to them. We will now talk about the girls' team about their game. Introduce yourselves. I'm Noel, I'm Nara. I'm Danielle. I'm Sam. I'm Adina. I'm Chloe. And this is part of the basketball team. Um, what was your most recent match? Yes, on nationals. On nationals. On nationals. The start of our nationals. Uh, Who did you play against? Uh, Twice. Twice. Cross. Teams. Set Catholics. Yeah. And that's so, all. Yeah. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Um... Did, do you think you played well as a team? Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. No, 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 Okay. So I was 
Are you prepared to call yourself the George Soto Girls Basketball yeah, yeah, yeah. Team? Yeah, yeah, yeah. One, two, one, two, one, two. Because we're the most successful team in the whole of Australian basketball team. And even though we lost, we lost. Let's go. We've got further than other ever basketball team in this season. Even the boys. We're still out with basketball. Yes, man. Peace out, Sucker. Okay. Boys team are crap. You'd skate. Yeah, our whole team was crap. Okay. Well done. Troll, 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 troll,